Hello, welcome to another episode of Cooking with Bach in Bach's Kitchen. Today I'm going to make braised fish, which is catfish. Uh, it's a traditional Vietnamese um, dish that you know it's just every you can do that every day. It's um, sweet, salty, and a little spicy, and you eat it over rice and. Of course, with some vegetable, stir fry vegetable on the side. Okay, the ingredients for kakha are some catfish nugget, sugar, pepper, salt, fish sauce, and a shallot, and a little bit of ginger. I'm going to slice up, chop up some shallots. and uh, some ginger. Actually, the ginger, I like to julienne it because that way you get a, a taste, a bite of it when you eat the dish. You notice I've used a lot of ginger in my cooking. The reason is that ginger, you know, has a soothing effect on your stomach. So it prevents you from having uh, hot burn, things like that. Next we go to make a um, caramel. It's about a quart, a quarter cup of sugar and a quarter cup of um, water and you boil this up until it caramelizes. Making the caramel is the long process for this dish. Uh, just like making the roux for Cajun food. You have to constantly watch it because you don't want to burn it. You can see that the sugar is getting to be golden brown it's almost there so you turn down the heat and uh, so that it does so that the sugar doesn't burn on you the sugar is ready so what I do is I am going to put the onion shallots chopped shallots and uh, chopped shallots and uh, ginger in so I have the chopped shallots and ginger in the caramel, stir it around. Good to add some coconut oil in it. chicken nugget, and not chicken nugget, catfish nugget in the sauce. Did I say chicken? It's, it's uh, fish nugget. It's catfish nugget. So you add that into it. Give it a nice stir. Turn up the heat. a lot of black pepper, about a tablespoon of um, fish sauce, and some salt. This dish is going to be salty and sweet. Let's 
see it nice and golden brown and you're going to cook it for about 15 minutes or so until the sauce is kind of like uh, thickens a little bit and that would go really good on um, rice and cover the pot up I'm going to get a lid and cover the pot up and reduce the fire to simmer while the fish is cooking I'm going to prepare for a uh, spinach stir fry with um, garlic as a side dish to accompany the braised catfish. So I'm going to chop up four or five cloves of garlic. So in a hot wok, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of um, coconut oil. Beat the coconut oil up until it's kind of like um, uh, smoky, smoking. I'm going to add the garlic into it. garlic brown a little bit. And I'm going to add the washed baby spinach. You can use any kind of uh, vegetable for this. You know, but tonight we just have to have spinach. Add a pinch of salt. Juice worth of uh, fish sauce. Poison, not poison, but um, oyster sauce. Turn it off, it's cooking up. And the dash of black pepper. You have spinach stir fry with garlic. We check on the fish, and you can see you know it's cooked already, and the sauce has reduced down. You adjust the seasoning to your taste. It has to be a little bit salty, but. So that's it, and uh, we're going to serve this. This is a traditional, everyday Vietnamese meal, including braised catfish or kakha, stir-fried vegetables served with rice, the do sao, which is the stir-fry and um, rice gum. If you have enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel so that if I put in some new video, you will be notified. Thank you. Bon appétit. See you soon.